And it may look like a, a mob trashing a corner store. Actually, it's the latest Bay Area strategy for saving the planet. Well, back here in San Francisco, the fight against global warming is taking on a bit of a mob mentality. And by that, we mean a raucous crowd storming a neighborhood store. What's it all about? On the Green Beat tonight, Jeffrey Schaub with how the anti-boycott works. These people aren't lining up for tickets to see Madonna or a chance to get the latest Sony game player. CFLs and bourbon together at last. It's about time, right? Somebody had to do it. I'm buying Lucky Charms for the food bank, because who doesn't like Lucky Charms? These people are at a San Francisco liquor store, mobbing the place, stripping the shelves of everything and anything, so the owner, seen here, will have enough money to fight global warming? There's even a video on YouTube. Global warming, ah, greatest threat civilization has ever known, right? Yeah, it's a good thing our government's all over that. It's called Carrot Mob, as in carrot and a stick. And it's the brainchild of San Franciscan Brent Shulkin. This was a big experiment to see, would these people come out of the woodwork? Does this idea have traction? And it did. In just three hours, carrot mobbers bought up enough goods to give the owners of K&D Liquors in the Mission over 9,000 bucks, three times more than the store would make in an entire day. The catch, K&D's owner has to spend 22% of that money, $1,800, to lower the store's carbon footprint. It was enough money for them to redo their entire lighting system, uh, all the lamps and the ballasts and the bulbs and the connectors and whatever they have. One of the things the owner of this store plans to do with his newfound energy money is upgrade these coolers and put different compressors in them. You'd be surprised. These use up to thousands of dollars a year in energy costs. Yes, I'm excited, and I can't wait to go by. Today, the corner market. Tomorrow, Carrot Mob plans to take on the corporate world. On the Green Beat, Jeffrey Schaub, CBS 5.